ever wondered about the kind of universal laws you hold for absolutely true but may probably be based on dysfunctional beliefs as humans it isn't unusual that we get upset and believe ourselves unsuccessful when we feel that those laws have been broken wanting to do well preferring to have things run easily and that people will always treat you well are rational and desirable ways of seeing things there's no question about that however if these are taken as absolute unbreakable laws and these wants are turned into demands the results are that we start to operate with shoulds the oughts and the musts and this in turn is like settling oneself up against reality operating on shoes is a sure way to experience failure way more often than is necessary life has its givens and the most realistic way to deal with them is to accept and work with them and do one's best to achieve success being realistic about the givens and our beliefs make up the underpinning facts of our existence how we perceive life and how we operate in the world there is no law that says you will always do well or that life and things will always be easy or that people will consistently aim to treat you the way you expect or believe they should or ought to. Our personal power thus lies in being conscious of these givens, not ignoring or denying their existence. It is all about doing one's best in spite of these facts operating in a brain-driven manner, not distressed or frustrated because of dysfunctional or misunderstood ways of seeing or interpreting the way things should be in the world. In this changing world, individuals, teams and organizations alike need to be future ready and resilient enough to create a more functional way of thinking and operating and achieving success. So a productive, realistic and brain friendly way is to start by recognizing the dysfunctional beliefs that one has in place. When it comes to the bedrock facts of your existence, how do you address thoughts, beliefs that unresourcefully affect the way you operate and probably experience success? Please share with me and if this is an aspect you struggle with as an individual, a team or organization and you need to work on it now sooner than later, please send me a message to discuss and explore further. Thank you very much.